the Zicklin School provides a tremendous amount of opportunities for every student that attends, especially when it comes to executives on campus program. It's really a matter of the student grasping that opportunity. Um, it's there, you just have to grab it. I knew that I wanted to become a CFO, so I looked at the list of CFOs and I picked a, a certain number of CFOs that I wanted to meet and Mr. Hickey was definitely one of them. And he was the top of my list. And I happened to meet uh, Mr. Hickey at one of the executive on campus roundtables. And that's how we got connected. Uh, I set up the first meeting through, through a secretary. And then when I went to the first meeting, Mr. Hickey was very clear on the expectations of what this meeting would entail in the future meetings. Um, on me driving the agenda, me setting up the questions, and on what I wanted to get out of every meeting. And so I find the time with him to be priceless. He's willing to help me through any trials and tribulations I'm going through and also to answer any type of question I'm willing to throw at him. You could tell from the first discussions with Charles that he had a confidence there, but just wasn't sure where to direct that. The year I was mentoring Charles, I had one other student, very proud to say the two of them, both Charles and Tom, uh, you know, both got internships, both, both got offers from those internships, both passed the CPA exam before they graduated. You know, so, you know, I mean, to me, that was a home run year. I think getting involved with the EOC was for a few reasons, <clears throat> part of which was to give back to the school. Uh, secondarily, when I looked at the, the diversity of the student body, you could see a lot of the students were coming from areas all over the world and could you know, probably use a mentor or a coach. And it was an opportunity also for me to stay connected with a younger generation and know what's important in their day-to-day -day lives.